Whether you're a personal trainer or running gym, a website will help you establish a strong online presence. So, in this video, I will show you everything that you need to know how to build a great fitness website on your own. So, get pumped and let's lift your fitness business to new heights. As you may already know, having a website is key. It boosts your brand's visibility, builds trust, and makes it easier for customers to find you through search engines, something social media alone just can't do. But I know that many people are intimidated by the thought of creating a website just because they think it's too difficult, expensive, or time consuming. But today I'll show you that with hosting your website builder, this is not the case. It's super easy, quick, and requires literally no coding or lots of technical knowledge. Just go to the description and click on the first link. This will take you to Hostinger's landing page. So scroll down a bit and you'll see the available website builder plans. I highly recommend choosing the business plan. Unlike the premium plan, it provides many AI tools for quicker content creation and e-commerce features, which lets you sell products, accept payments, and set up email notifications. And if you have any questions about the plans, you can always ask the AI sales assistant and it will surely help you out. All right, after selecting the plan, you need to choose its duration. Going for the four year plan saves you the most in the long run. Plus you get a free domain for one year. So I recommend choosing that one. Next, fill out your payment details and be sure to use our coupon code WB10, which will give you an extra 10% discount. So type it over here and finalize the purchase by clicking submit secure payment. And now it's time to turn on your creative energy and start building your website. After you make a purchase, you'll start setting up your site straight away. For starters, choose between using the AI website builder or a pre-made template. I'm going with the AI builder this time, as it offers a more personalized approach and simplifies the design process. As you can see, the builder is asking to specify the type of website I wish to construct. Here, I will choose the business showcase. Then add your company's name and describe what you do and how you want your site to look. So, as a professional yoga instructor, which I am not, I would type in something like this. It's a small yoga studio for a healthy body and soul. We offer group and individual classes, and the website should be minimalistic, calm, and nature inspired. Then you can go to personalization settings to choose a color scheme for your website or let AI decide for you. After you're finished, simply click create a website and watch the AI builder complete its task in under a minute. Once it's finished, you'll see a preview of your website. As you can tell, the content already mirrors the business description that you provided, but of course, that's not it. You can adjust and edit the site any way you want. So if you like what you see, hit edit site and this will take you to the website manager area. Now the editing process is super, super simple. One of my favorite things about the website builder is its drag and drop functionality. You can just grab any element and move it around, delete it or resize it just like this. The website pages are over here at the top and the sidebar menu is on the left. Here you can add a new element like text, buttons or images. The next one is for pages. You can move them around and add drop downs or add new ones. You can also work on changing fonts, adding animations and it's all super simple so just play around and look for what you need. Speaking of what you need, you'll definitely need lots of high quality content for your site. And I know that it's easier said than done though. Creating a captivating text or visuals can require lots of time. And let's be real, not all of us are Da Vinci's or Shakespeare's. But luckily with hosting a website builder, you won't need to magically transform into a content creator, writer, or graphic designer. You can just use AI tools and save you some precious time. One of the tools is the AI image generator. You won't need to spend hours browsing through stock images online or creating anything yourself. Just type in the description of what you want to see in the image and then pick a style. For example, I want to see a woman doing yoga in the forest and I'll choose a cinematic style for this. Click on create images and the AI will quickly generate images based on the description. Pick the one you like and place it on the site or try a new prompt. If you want something more dynamic than a static picture, go ahead and choose a video. There's a big selection of high quality videos in the video library. Speaking of images, having your brand's logo is essential for your brand's awareness and credibility. If you already have one, make sure to add it to the website. You can do that by clicking edit header, then select logo and here you can upload your logo file and control its width. 
But if you don't have a logo, that's not a big deal at all. You can quickly create one using Website Builder's AI Logo Maker. Just click over here and you will be taken to a separate page of the Logo Maker. Describe what you want to see in your logo, for instance, a person doing yoga in nature, and choose a style for it. AI will generate some options for you to choose from. You can download the one you like or click on edit and add your brand's name or slogan and edit its color, font and spacing. After you're done, hit the download button and upload your logo on the header. Another cool thing that you can do with your logo is add it to your website's tab or in other words, add a favicon. To do that, go to the general settings of the left sidebar and choose favicon. Upload your logo and hit save changes. This will make your site more recognizable. The next tool I want to cover is the AI Writer. It's a true lifesaver for crafting long paragraphs. For example, a business backstory. You can just drop in a short description and let the AI do the rest. So I'll put in my description over here and click create text. And voila, I've got a full paragraph without breaking a sweat. You can also write the text with the AI Writer by clicking anywhere on the site's text bar like so. I don't know about you, but I rarely scroll past the top few results when searching for something on Google. So I stick with what's at the top and guess what? Most people do the same thing. That's why search engine optimization is a big deal. You want your brand right up there on page one. So when you're crafting content for your site, make sure it's SEO friendly. For example, if I had a small yoga studio in downtown LA, which to be honest would be really cool, I could include location specific terms like yoga studio in LA or Los Angeles yoga classes in my website's content to attract people who are looking for yoga classes in that area. So think of keywords that are the most relevant to your brand and make sure to include them in the AI writer's description so that it can produce SEO friendly content for your site. Now, if you're feeling a bit lost with all this SEO thing, don't you worry. Website Builder has great built-in tools for this, so you don't need to go out and look for additional plugins or services. To access the SEO settings, go to the left sidebar, click on the three dots and select SEO settings. Right from the beginning, you may notice that some pages have these yellow exclamation points next to them. Don't you worry. The yellow marks mean that these pages have areas where SEO improvements are needed. So select the page you want to go work on and then click on generate new SEO info. The SEO AI assistant will ask you to describe your page and provide the main keywords. I'll put in something like this right here. After that, you'll need to choose the three main keywords. So for this example, I'll go with these ones. The AI assistant has already constructed the SEO title and meta description for your website. You can also see how it will appear on search engines too. Just edit the text if you need or hit on finish. The website builder also provides some tips and highlights the areas that need more attention, so make sure to check them as well. To rank even higher in the search engines, I also suggest publishing blog posts regularly on topics related to your services while incorporating relevant keywords. Other important SEO factors, including website speed, are already taken care of by Hostinger. If you're interested in learning more about SEO best practices, be sure to watch this video over here next. Okay. Back to our business. Having a website is not all about marketing, but also about functionality. Through the website, you can easily interact with the clients and manage sales and bookings. If your business has products to sell, like fitness equipment or workout plans, you can add an online store to your site. To do that, go ahead and select online store on the left toolbar, then hit add store. The website builder will create a new page to display your products. Then come back to the sidebar and select manage store. First things first, the website builder will ask you to choose the country and currency in which you want to sell your products. Once you do that, you'll be taken to the store manager area where you can edit your store, add products, select a payment method and more. So let's start by adding products. Hit on add product and select whether it's a physical, digital or service product. Let's say I'm selling a one year yoga workout plan, so it's going to be a digital product. As you can see over here, you can insert the image of the item you want to sell and add the information about it below. Or you can save your time and ask AI to help you out over here too. Select generate text and the AI will write you a description based on your product's picture. Pretty cool, right? Then select the price for your product or add additional information. By the way, if you have a digital product that you want your customers to access for free, you can remove the payment by clicking on the price type and switching it from amount to free. After you're done with that, go ahead and press save. 
your product will appear in the products list. To make your store look nice and neat, I recommend adding categories for your products. To do so, go to categories and simply click here to add a new one. Enter your category's name like yoga workout plans, click on assign products and choose the ones that fit in this category. Then press save. As you can see, my one year workout plan now has a separate category. The next step is to add a payment method. Click on add payments and select how you want your customers to pay. After the step, make sure to add your company's official name, address and contact information as it will appear in the invoices and email confirmations. And finally, you'll need to choose the shipping options. Decide where you ship and how much you will charge for it. With a website builder, not only can you sell products, but also allow customers to book workout sessions easily on your website. It's pretty simple, really. All you need to do is choose appointments on the left menu and click enable appointments. Now you'll have to specify your availability so that the people can book appointments accordingly. Just click on edit availability and type in or select your working hours. You can also click the plus icon right here to add more time slots in one day. Once you've done this, remember to save your changes. You may also click on block time to block the appointments on the days you won't be working, let's say a vacation. The next step is to create an appointment product. Click on the product section on the left and then on add product. Choose appointment as the product type. As with other product types, you can add a picture and then fill in the information such as the title. So for this one, it's going to be yoga session. And don't forget to add the description to it too. Next, ensure the add to bag button is enabled and then choose the price type. Note that you can choose between free and paid bookings for your clients. The free option allows your customers to book an appointment without paying. But if you want a paid booking, click on amount and specify a minimum price of one US dollar. Then write down the location and duration of your appointment. Just note that the minimum duration is 15 minutes. In the appointment conditions, you can set the minimum notice. For example, if I need two days from now to prepare for a yoga session, a client won't be able to book the event for today or tomorrow. Finally, double check that your business hours are set correctly in the your availability section. If it's all good, go ahead and click the save button. Creating appointments with Website Builder is pretty easy and convenient. Here are some extra facts to take into account. So first, don't be afraid of double bookings. The time slots are dedicated to one client and do not overlap. Also, if you're wondering about the time zones, don't worry about that too. Your working hours are set according to your device's time zone, but the clients see available time slots based on their time zones. And lastly, only unpaid and unfulfilled appointments can be canceled. For paid appointments, you must issue a refund first. If you want more information about that, check the link in the description. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for. Once you're done perfecting your site, the only thing left to do here now is publish it. But before we go online, I recommend reviewing the site to make sure there are no mistakes. You can do that by selecting the preview button right here. It will show you how your website will look once published. Since your website will also be accessed on mobile phones, we want to make sure it looks just as amazing on them as it does on desktops. We can do that by clicking this mobile icon at the top of the screen to change the preview to mobile view. You can edit it as you like if you want to make any corrections. It works the same way as the computer version and the changes in the mobile view do not affect the desktop one. Now it's time to connect your website to a domain name. The domain name is also a big part of marketing and helps to secure your place on the internet. So think about it very carefully and make it short yet relevant to your brand. To do that, go to the top bar and hit the connect domain button. Simply enter the domain name, select its extension and check to see if it's not taken. And as you can see, the domain is free for one year as the plan suggested. The rest is fairly simple. You'll just need to insert your information and finish the registration. Once connected, visitors will be able to reach your site by typing in the selected domain name. And that's it! The site is polished and ready to see for its first visitors. So all there's left to do now is hit the go live button and now your site is officially up and running. And there you have it. I hope this video helped you out and if you need any more help, leave us a comment down below and be sure to check out our YouTube channel for more helpful videos like this one. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.